All right, let's get her unpacked. Well, I got the saw all unpacked, and it's broken right out of the box. It's got the blade guide down here on the bottom. It's broken and pushed in. I'll show you here. Right there on the blade guide, broken right out of the box. I ended up having my saw blade catch on that. So I'm going to have to see if I can take it back to the store to exchange it, or if they'll just send me that piece. Hi Wendy, my name's Dan. Um, I just received a 12 inch compound uh, double bevel miter saw as a gift uh, and I just took it out of the box and it's there's a piece on it that's broken uh, right out of the box here. Um, I, I already got it home and got it all set up and it's an awful big thing to bring back. Uh, can I have you guys uh, send me a replacement part, or do I need to bring the whole saw back, or what? Um, here's the thing. We don't carry the replacement parts for them here. Um, in your book, the Ono here, Ono, oh my goodness, I can't even speak this morning. In the manual on the back page, there should be an 800 number with a parts listing. Mm-hmm. Um, you can call back and see what, if they've got the parts that you need. Alrighty. Uh, I'm sure the I'm sure the person that purchased it for me does. Okay, because on, on that case, if you don't want to order the part, you can always bring it back in with the receipt, and we can swap it out for you. Okay, well, if you guys are willing to swap it out for me, could we just take the part off of the saw that I would be exchanging out anyway? It's just uh, six screws. Um, let me ask my boss real quick, and I'll get right back to you. All right. I am. Um, what piece is broken? It's, uh, I'm not sure what it's called. It's the plastic part that the blade goes down into. Uh, let me see if I can find a part uh, listing here. Click for it. It's on the bottom of the saw. It is called the kerf board. The kerf board? Yeah, it's the, it's a, basically it, when you pull the chop saw down, the, the spinning blade goes down in inside of that uh, as it cuts through the board, and this one looks like it, well, the front of it's broken, so I'm assuming they got jammed. It's a plastic part. So I can't just exchange the one part, I have to package this all back no, up? No, because of the fact that it's going to take a minute to take off the other piece. So we'd rather you just bring in the, the old one and get a brand new one. Okay. Alrighty, sorry. Yep. Alright, thank you. Yep, thanks. So instead of being able to take just six screws out and take this back to Harbor Freight, they're going to make me package this whole thing back up, take it back down there, and then they'll exchange the whole saw for another one. Well, I guess I can get it fixed, but it's a whole other trip. I guess I gotta do what I gotta do.
Hi, my name is Dan Rogers. I uh, received a 12 inch compound double bevel miter saw as a gift. I just got it unpacked and the kerf board on it is broken. I called the store and they've told me just to bring the whole saw back and exchange it, but you know, it's a good sized saw and it's quite a bit out of my way to go all the way back to the store to exchange it for just a kerf board. So I wanted to know if you guys could just send me a new curve board for the saw. What's the item, what's the item number for the saw? The item number is 69684. Okay, give me a few seconds here. Okay. All right. So then I have to take it back to the store, right? Um, yeah, yes, sir. All right. Thank you. Twenty six minutes on hold for them to tell me they don't have a part. That's disappointing. Now I need to go 30 miles to take the saw back to exchange it to drive 30 miles back again. I get 10 miles to the gallon. That's so going to cost me six gallons of gas. So it's going to end up costing me at four dollars a gallon, 25 bucks basically, to go back, exchange it, and bring it back to my house. Disappointed, Harbor Freight. Disappointed.